Hi you guys and thank you so much for tuning into my channel. So today I have a mystery box to show you from Juvia's Place. This was the Black Friday mystery bag. Do you want to know what's in my box? Stay tuned. Okay you guys. So this just arrived. This is the Black Friday mystery bag by Juvia's Place. I don't know if they normally have mystery bags like this, but I grabbed two of them. One for me and one is going to be for one of you guys. So stay tuned to the end and you can find out how to enter if you are interested in one of these. So I don't know if they're going to be the same. I'm going to assume so. I cut the tape because I thought it was going to come in a bag because... <laughs> The image that you see online shows Juvia's place in this little bag that has their logo on it. So I thought it was going to come, you know, in a bag, but I open it thinking I could just pull out a bag and no, I couldn't. All of the products are just like tossed in there. So this is going to be like one, one and one, and then the products underneath. So, um, they're all mixed in, just jumped in there and they all look like they are similar colors to what I can see on the top. So I don't know if they're all going to be the same or if just my box, both of them are the same. I don't know, but I paid $35 each bag and it's supposed to have lip products, a glow highlighter, a pleasant new surprise, a six pan and a 16 pan. And again, it was $35, but it did not say what the retail value is. But if I can find a retail value, I will let you guys know, but it only says $35 and that's all it says. <laughs> so let's go ahead and see again. That's what it looks like when you open up the box. That's as far as I've got. So I'm going to go ahead and set one of each of these aside <laughs> and one of these aside. So everything that's on top right now, we'll go through. So we'll go through this one first. I almost just threw it at my face. And this one is a loose highlighter. There is the packaging. On the inside, that is what it looks like. And it's a loose highlighter. I'm not gonna open it because I don't know what I'll do with mine, but that is what the loose highlighter looks like. I normally don't use loose highlighter. And I don't know why. And I'm torn if I should actually keep this one or not, but maybe I should. So let's just see what, let's see what it looks like. I probably will never use it, but let's just see. Whoa, it's a whole lot of poofing going, ooh, whoa, whoa. Okay, now that I've made a highlighter mess, there's that. Let me just knock some off and put some on my, ooh. There's that, I'll put it, ooh. That is a really nice color. There you go. So it's like a nice subtle shine, not too blinding, not like, where are you? But it's like, hey, I'm over here, you guys. I think that's nice. <laughs> I like that. So there is a highlighter. There's the first product right there. And then here's the first packaging on the first lip product. And it says, it's a lip balm, passion fruit. And that's what the packaging looks like. It looks like a test tube. And it's a lip balm right there. So we probably won't have much color, no? It's just like a light pink. So you have a lip balm. Hmm. That's nice. It's cute packaging. Looks like a test tube almost, but like a vial. But that is really cute. You can drop that in your purse, your book bag, whichever. And yeah, that. So there's a lip balm. And then here's another lip product. This one says wine, the red wine, velvety matte lipstick, rude girl. How cute, it's like an ombre, the top is red and then it goes to a pink on the bottom. It has their logo right on the top and it says rude girl on the bottom. And whoa, whoa, is that like a blackberry? Like what in the world? That is dark, oh, hello. That is a dark color, you guys. Very, very dark, but I bet you it would look really nice. I'm sure you guys are gonna want to know what this looks like on these little tenning girls of mine, or at least some of you guys are, or at least I know one of you guys will. <laughs> Let me just go ahead and put it on for you because, oh, holy moly, okay. 
I don't know. This looks like the darkest color I've ever probably had this close to my mouth, but let's see. It is all up on my teeth. Let me tell you. But there you go. <laughs> now that I get this shit off my teeth, I actually like it. What do you guys think? She likes it. And it's dark. Like, oh. See how it looks different though? Like this looks like almost like a dark purple. That's why I was confused. I was like, wait, whoa, whoa. Wait, it's more of like a burgundy, but this color looks like a dark purple. Hmm. But I like it. What do you think? What do you think? What do you think? Especially for like the holidays coming up, a dark burgundy matte lipstick, that would be nice. So there's that. So now let's dig down in the box and see what else we have in here. So it looks like here's going to be, yep, there's two palettes there. And here's two palettes here. And that's everything. So now I'm confused on the new, um, where it says a pleasant new surprise. So unless they're calling one of these lip products the pleasant new surprise, because literally it says lip products, plural, S, one six pan, one 16 pan high, um, eyeshadow palette. And then it says a glow highlighter, which that's what we got. And then a pleasant new surprise. I don't know, but let's look at the palettes. Let's go with the six pans first. So again, there is two of them. So I will set one aside and I will open one of these. Now I don't have this one, I don't believe. It's, this is the Topes by Juvia. So if they're like taupe colors, that's gonna be nice. Here's the actual package and the back. And ooh, very pretty. I definitely was not expecting that. That is super, super pretty. I can definitely do a really pretty look with that. I like that there's a combination of the mattes and the shimmers and the light to darker colors in there. And it only is a six pan. So I actually like that. Plus I feel like this is more wearable colors for anybody to get this mystery box. So there's the first palette. Now let's go with the second palette. And again, there is two of them. This one though, however, looks like it might've been on the top of a box when somebody cut it, cause there's a slit, you're not gonna be able to see it, but there's literally a slit that starts here and goes all the way up this box. So I will open up this box cause I'm gonna throw my box away and I'll leave this box that's not cut for one of you guys. So let me open this one so we can see the colors of this palette. The Magic Mini by Juvia's. There's the packaging, there's the back. And when we open her up, ooh, whoa, that is very colorful. Here, let me take that off. That is a very colorful palette. So I like that they give you, okay, so they're giving you a non-colorful palette and then a whole lot of colors over here. So you kind of get a mixed variety, which I like that. This one can be toned down if you don't want to do some of the bright colors because there are a few neutral colors in here but there are some really beautiful blues and greens. So I actually like that. And I like that it's a big 16 pan. Again, I don't own a big palette by Juvia's Place. I do have, I think, two or three of this size already. So that is really neat that I get to add to my Juvia's Place palettes and I get some lip products and a highlighter that I actually opened and now I'm gonna keep. <laughs> So that is everything that came in the Black Friday Juvia's Place mystery bag for 2020. Definitely comment down below, you guys. Let me know what did you think of the items that were inside? Did you purchase one? Did you know about them? Let me know all the details down below. Your positive interaction means the world and I greatly do appreciate it. Now, if you guys are interested in getting one of these sets for yourself, because again, I did purchase one for me and I purchased one for one of you guys. So if you are interested in winning, then same simple rules of all my giveaways. Number one, you must be subscribed to my channel. That's why I do what I do when I do it to give back to those who are here actively and positively supporting me on my channel. So be subscribed Two, give this video a big thumbs up and leave one comment down below. In that comment, I want you to say 
since this is called the magic mini, I don't know why this just came to my head, but just put down, let the magic begin. If you want to enter, put in one comment, let the magic begin with whatever you want. You can put it as creative as you would like, but only one comment per username entering in for the giveaway. You can leave as many comments as you would like, but only one with the giveaway in it. So let the magic begin with whatever else you would like to put in that comment. You must be over the age of 18 or have a legal parent or guardian entering for you. So I will be communicating with somebody over the age of 18 and you must have a United States address. I don't care where you live as long as I'm mailing it to a United States address. And that is all you guys. Be subscribed, like this video, leave one comment down below with the words that I said and be over the age of 18 and have a United States address. That is it. I will have this run for two weeks. At the end of the two weeks, I will use a random comment picker. Comment picker? I get that confused sometimes and some other word tries to pop out of my mouth. So I have to re make sure I'm saying it correctly. Yes, a random comment picker. And I will have them cipher through all of the comments that say, let the magic begin as the keywords for it to search for. And then once it does give me a winner, I will go back to your comment and I will say, congratulations, you are the current winner on this giveaway. You have 48 hours to contact me back. If you don't contact me back within the 48 hours, I will go back to the random comment picker. Same thing, have it draw a new person, the new winner. I'll say the same thing. You now have the same roles, have 48 hours to get back to me until I get a confirmed win. In the description box down below, I will have the official roles, the official end date in case there's any questions. And I will say congratulations to so-and-so once this is over. And then I'll say has 48 hours to confirm if they haven't confirmed just yet. But once they have confirmed, I will say confirmed. So if it still says has 48 hours to confirm, hold tight. I may need to choose a new winner. The new winner might be you. So that is everything, you guys. I honestly feel this was a really good box for $35 each. We're getting two palettes, getting two lip products and a highlighter. I still have no clue about this new special item unless it's one of the lip products and then they shouldn't have put an S at the end. So I don't know, but that is everything that I have to show you guys for this mystery bag. And yeah, again, comment down below. Let me know what you thought about it. And until next time, you know that drill. Keep a smile on that gorgeous face of yours and I'll see you on the next one. Bye, Crafty Crew, out.